With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, I am your teacher to this question and the question is three solutions of X, Y and Z of HCl are mixed to produce 100 ml of 0.1 molar solution. The molarities of X, Y and Z are 0.07 molar, 0.12 molar and 0.15 molar respectively. What respective volumes of X and Y should be mixed? So, it is given in the question that there are three solutions of X, Y and Z of HCl which are mixed to produce a solution whose final volume is 100 milliliter and final molarity is 0.1 molar. And the molarities of X, Y and Z solutions are 0.07 molar, 0.12 molar and 0.15 molar respectively. So we have to calculate their respective volumes that in what volume should they mix to produce the uh, final volume of 100 ml and molarity of 0.1 molar. So according to question the final volume of the solution is 100 ml it means V1 plus V2 plus V3 should be 100 ml. So first we will check the options that which options are correct according to this. First is 50 ml, 25 ml and 25 ml. This will be equal to 100 ml. So this verifies this condition. Second option is 20 ml, 60 ml and 20 ml. This is also equal to 100 ml. So this also verifies the, this condition. Third option is 40 ml, 30 ml and 30 ml. This also verifies this condition. And fourth option is 55 ml, 20 ml and 25 ml. So this also verifies this condition that V1 plus V2 plus V3 is equal to 100 ml. So we cannot directly see by seeing the options uh, do this. So we will do this by formula that is the final molarity of the solution is M that is M1 plus V1 plus M2 V2 plus M3 V3 upon v1 plus v2 plus v3 that is this is the final molar concentration of the solution in which three different molar concentration of solution are mixed so the final molar concentration of the solution here is given 0.1 molar m1 is 0 0.07 into v1 plus m2 is 0.12 into V2 plus M3 is 0.15 into V3 and V1 plus V2 plus V3 is equal to 100 ml as the final solution volume is 100 ml. So by multiplying this 100 by 0.1 molar it will be equal to 10 is equal to 0 0.07 into V1 plus 0 0.12 into V2 plus 0 0.15 into V3. So this is our equation and we have to put the different options V1, V2 and V3 in this and check which option is correct for this. So by taking first option that is V1 is 50 ml, 25 ml and 25 ml. So by putting this 0 0.07 into 50 plus 0 0.12 into 25 plus 0 0.15 into 25 this will be equal to 10.75. This is not equal to 10 so this is the incorrect option. Next one is the 20 ml, 60 ml and 20 ml. So by putting this 0 0.07 into 20 plus 0 0.12 into 60 plus 0 0.15 into 20 it will be equal to 11.6. It is not 
also equal to 10 so it is also incorrect option so coming to the third C option that is 40 ml 30 ml and 30 ml so putting this 0 0.07 into 40 plus 0 0.12 into 30 plus 0 0.15 into 30 this is equal to 10.9 this is also not equal to 10 so this is also incorrect option so checking the last option that is 55 ml 20 ml and 25 ml 0 0.07 into 55 plus 0 0.12 into 20 plus 0 0.15 into 25 this is equal to 10 so this is the correct option so D is the correct option that is 55 ml 20 ml and 25 ml it means the volume of solution X is taken 55 ml volume of solution V should be take 20 ml and volume of solution Z should be taken 25 ml to give the final volume 100 ml and concentration 0.1 molar so this these are the different volumes in which these solutions should be mixed to produce final volume of 100 ml of 0.1 molar solution I hope you understood this solution. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITJ and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.